Well, right now, a New York-based development group is doing something different to try and lure shoppers to Vestavia Hills. Now, today, the company put out an online survey using the city's website to get feedback from neighbors. CBS 42 News reporter Michael Clark's live in Vestavia right now with why people there say this is needed, Michael. Many of our area's shopping centers and malls just aren't what they used to be, leaving some neighbors to stare at empty storefronts and watch money being spent elsewhere. But tonight, the new owners of this property want your feedback on potential future improvements. Faded store signs and inside construction showing the constant changes at Vestavia's city center. You want to be able to go to a city center where you have your friends, want to be able to meet, and it's just, it's really important for growth, for, I mean, everything. Isabella Sanchez Navarro and her friend work out daily at Planet Fitness. She's one of the many neighbors Cat's Properties hopes to hear from in an online survey. Seems like it would be a pretty good thing to do with a lot of these storefronts being really vacant. Um, it's a really great spot, uh, and it would be nice to see all these spots filled. With more than two dozen responses in just today, many want to see more local restaurants and shops with variety. Neighbors say it's hard to know what tenants are nestled in some parts of the shopping center. And you just can't really see them and don't really know what's out here based from the street. So that might be a big part of it. But um, other than that, I mean, I feel like they got, they got quite a bit to offer. Survey takers agree the center has potential with its location. And Cats Properties hopes they can improve the experience based on feedback. What we do is we try to play off of the uses that are there. We look for national tenants. We look for strong regional tenants and then local moms and pops, if you will. And we find that the best shopping centers have a, a mix of all three. Shoppers will have to wait another month or two to learn about future tenants, but are excited about the possibilities for the city. More local places would be great. I've noticed that lately that's what people like to go to. Now back here live, there are restaurants out here, but many of them are closed now at 10 o'clock. And with a gym open later, some have suggested the idea of a local pub or eatery that stays open late and also making some improvements to the parking situation here at the city center. Of course, if you want to weigh in, we'll have a link on how to do that through our CBS 42 News app. For now, reporting live in Vestavia Hills, Michael Clark, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.